Hi, this is Zach with Expert Village, and today I'm going to talk to you about refilling your ink cartridges. This is a good idea if you want to save some money, and uh, it's also a really good idea because some new cartridges for printers can cost around $70 to $80, and a refill kit might cost the same price, but you can use it to refill your cartridges uh, a numerous times. And most kits will come with a tool to puncture your ink cartridge, and uh, a tube of ink along with a syringe tip for inserting the ink into the cartridge. You'll also need something to seal the ink cartridge once you've punctured it. We're going to use hot glue, but you could also use scotch tape or uh, any other kind of airtight flat tape. Duct tape is not recommended because it's ridged and uh, that actually lets air into your cartridge and can cause leaking of the ink and it can uh, really not be good for your printer. Um, so the first step is to open your printer and remove the cartridge you want to fill. Uh, and we're going to refill this black cartridge which uh, has already been refilled before so you can see there's hot glue sealing the top. Uh, first thing you're going to need is uh, a piece of tape and in this case uh, duct tape can work but uh, it's only for a short-term cover and not something that you actually want to seal the ink cartridge with. Um, this is to make sure that your ink doesn't leak while you're working with the cartridge. So you want to keep this pressed over the ink, the cartridge head, and you want to make sure that it's very tight and you keep the pressure on the whole time you're working with the cartridge. Um, so I'm going to peel back the hot glue. Now we're going to fill the cartridge. You, don't, you want to make sure that when filling the cartridge, the needle doesn't go all the way in. It should only be towards the top because once you fill it and release the pressure from the ink bottle, uh, it's going to cause some of that ink to go back up into the bottle if it's down too far. Um, so we're going to put the needle in just a little bit, enough to make sure it's in there, and then just squeeze and it'll fill your cartridge. And you should fill slowly and you can watch the ink level rise as you fill the cartridge. Once you've filled your cartridge with ink, you can place tape or re-glue the hole uh, very simply. Just you don't have to use too much. And after placing the glue, uh, you might want to blow on it and make sure it cools down. And after a little period of cooling, you can use your finger to press the glue down over the hole and make sure that it's airtight 